It's nice to see you. Nice to see you too. You resigned your post at the NAACP and you started a discussion on race and what it means in this country. Did this come as a surprise to you or did you always expect the lid would be blown off that story at some point? The timing of it was a shock. I mean, wow. We can't talk about the big picture of this without talking about the small picture first. Let me just ask you a question again in simple terms. Are you an African American woman? I, I identify as black. You identify as black. Let me put a picture up of you in your early 20s. And when you see this picture, is this an African American woman or is it a Caucasian woman? That's not in my early 20s, but... That's a little younger, I guess? <laughs> I was 17 in that picture. Is she a Caucasian woman or an African American woman? I would say visibly she would be identified as white by people who see her. But at that time you were identifying yourself as an African American woman? In that picture? During that time? No. When did you start deceiving people? When someone said to you, are you black or white? You would say, I'm black. You wouldn't say, I identify as black. Well, I do take exception to that. It's a little more complex than me identifying as black or answering a question of, are you black or are you white? You are white. I'm black. In that picture, you are as white as Casper the Friendly Ghost. <sighs> it's complex. You wouldn't understand. I understand just fine. In that picture, you were so white, you would have got a sunburn just standing in front of a TV. I don't have to take this. I'm out of here. You were so white in that picture, your credit score must have been perfect. Go screw yourself! Well, I guess it's time for a commercial break.